I recently uploaded this funny video to TikTok, but I did so for a very particular reason. I think it raises an important question in the church today. I'm often asked, why do so many young priests seem to be wearing the Roman collar in public? Interestingly, the answer has a lot less to do with doctrine and a lot more to do with local law. As it says in Canon 284, clerics are to wear suitable ecclesiastical garb according to the norms issued by the Conference of Bishops and according to legitimate local customs. This means it's ultimately up to the bishops what priests do and do not wear. The reality is, however, that most bishops' conferences allow a lot of freedom in this area. In Australia, it ranges from priests wearing a shirt with a lapel cross to a clergy shirt like this one, all the way up to a Roman cassock. But the fact that so many young priests are trending towards the traditional dress has raised some controversy in the church. And why is that? It's because only a few decades ago, it was a common sentiment among priests that to wear one's clericals in public was tantamount to lording one's priesthood over lay people. And so to wear secular clothing was considered to be the most pastoral approach. So why the return to more traditional dress? I think a major reason is because of the rapid decline of Christian culture in the West. In the wake of this rapid decline, it makes sense now more than ever to have a strong, visible witness of the church in society today. So today, for so many young priests, wearing our clericals in public is a simple and visible way to declare our commitment to Christ and his church. I think it goes without saying, if the priest needs his clericals to know that he's a priest, we've got a problem. As the old saying goes, the habit maketh not the much. But in a world so devoid of the gospel of Jesus, these simple visible signs can act as a reminder of God's presence in the world. Already in my under two years of priesthood, I've had multiple encounters wearing my clericals in cafes, in supermarkets, and on the streets, uh, where I've had the opportunity to talk to people about the gospel, about the law, and in one instance, bring a person back into the faith. So the reason for the return to this is not about restoring some kind of tyrannical power to priests, but bearing visible witness to Christ and his church in the world. So maybe as a point of reflection, what visible witness might you make to the world? God bless.